closed at the theater now. The metro entrance should be pretty close. But however small the distance is, we'll have to cover it on the surface. And there, every step you take could well be your last. Chuvak, we are here. Pull yourself together. We don't have long before nightfall, okay? Okay, with the tunnel collapse, the only way to reach the escalator down to the other station is cross the surface. And trust me, we don't want to be caught out here in the fucking dark. Opa, we're in luck, Artyomich! This place seems lived in. Rangers probably, I don't know. And when there are rangers? Shit! Short on filters. We'll have to make do. Now come on, take what you need. We're all brothers in the metro. Hey, Prieti, I could use a good watch like yours. Knowing how much air you got left is a must, huh? further business here. Let's move forward. You know, I have heard of things roaming around that even bullets can stop. You have been through some bad shit, I know, but not like what's coming. Artyom, remember, if you want to live, don't drop your guard for an instant, okay? I heard about this place. That plane was headed into Moscow when the whole city caught fire. Uh, the building was crashed. That's the end of it. The ice is still in up here. It's almost like spring, huh, Artyomich? Maybe we'll live to see the summer. Wait, 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 wait. There's got to be an underground path somewhere around here. The rangers would never cross the square out of the open. Okay. We could walk down the wing here. Okay, so much for the sun. Those clouds moved in fast.
I'll give cover. Jump! Oh, yeah, let's try together. Look, Artyom, don't lose your head in here. You understand me? Okay, let's go. One ranger told me this was a flight from Mallorca. Family is returning from vacation, you know? No, Wasn't meant to be. I feel. I don't know. I feel weird. Chuck, are you seeing this shit too? I feel. like you will take me. Not yet. Okay? Well, that's a good one. Looks like that one's all of them. Fucking 
Watchmen, as soon as we moved away from the plane and we were almost there, huh? The plane! The moving in from the second floor! <sighs> The entrance to the theater is around the next corner. We have to move now. Follow me faster, faster. Come over here. Go. Give me a hand. Blaster! More are coming! Bulia, you're gonna find the entrance! Above you! There you are! Shit! Too many of them! We have to warn the station! Get to the escalator! Hurry up! Now! Move down! They're still after us! The phantom of the past is over. Pavel and I helped each other out again and are returning down to the metro as real partners now. You can't survive the wastelands any other way. But now ahead of us lies the populated station. The theater. It's very close to Polis. If Pavel manages to lead me through the red line guard posts, I'll be home in less than an hour. times, right? They're going up soon. Are there many watchmen around? We were lucky to get here. Okay, there's a nest in the building by the wrecked plane. Man, I wonder if it's such a bad view today. Oh, you want a nightmare? Oh, it's waiting for you up there. No sense going with just three men. <laughs> clear a nest. We need a couple squads at least. So what now? You're not going? We can gather them here first. We're waiting for the guys. On their way. No Artyomich, so, if it's culture you want, the Bolshoi is up there above us. All the actors who survived are here. Well, people come from all over the metro to see the shows they put on. But why? Why to us? They keep raising the standards. Last time it was our neighbors. This time, it's us. Would be long before Fiora has the station to himself. So, that's our plan. The station next to this one is Revolution Square. One of ours. Red. And Revolution is fitting distance to police. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through. And you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Are you the one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in then. So, my Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here. Huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Welcome. Have a good rest. But you do understand that we can't wait for forever. Look, I don't make the rules, okay? Who does that? It's so hard to either accept us or send us on our way. Bullets to the last surviving theatrical critic. Bullets for mercy on your souls. 
go, young man. I see you like my witty sign. There's a place for everyone in this underground. Murderers, whores, tyrants, money changers, even peasants, for Christ's sake. All are welcome here, even lousy actors. I live in a theater where we breathe the miasma of the decaying Bolshoi. This station is overpopulated with the ghosts of the opera. But is there a place here for the best critic of our once great country? Hell no. I tell the truth. And I am repaid with insults and poverty? I say you are a disgrace to the name of Bolshoi. And they reply, now Bolshoi is us and us alone. They're immune to criticism. They choose money over art. And these poor souls traveling from all over Metro to see the glorious Bolshoi? They are played for fools. They say that art only interests the well-fed. But, my young friend, I will argue that even the hungry need art. For thinking on exalted matters dulls the pain of an empty stomach. But, sadly, True art is 20 years gone. What remains is profane trash. And so my own hunger persists. Will you honor what we've lost by perhaps donating a bullet? I disgust myself when we sit with dreams, party lights, but all around us radiation, death, decay. What? Oh, is this is it something you know? Look, as if mushrooms with mushroom sauce. Gotcha. Keep your hands off the pot. Or you're getting smacked in the head. Why? What happened? Yeah. Something we know. Wow. That's a demon. So scary, just like the okay. real thing. A demon. Look at the bloody eyes! It's attacking! So, Mr. when do we become your own father? Have you got enough money to last a week? Right. A week? Two days, maybe. Then my life is over. And it took so long to save up. Oh, well. Good riddance. At least I had some fun in the head. What? You give up yeah, all the best stopping power of the world. Simply the best of near AIDS. Look, I got money for three days. So drinks are on me. Best thing to have when there's many of them and only one of you. These will surely make your enemy work up a sweat. A great thing this is, and it's shit too. Good luck, come again. Incendiary grenades, guaranteed to keep your enemy warm. Leather, best leather goods, original designs, low prices. Shrooms, great shrooms, can't find better stuff This is anywhere. great stuff. The best you find. We spent the entire day in the right place. This can't get home. I was here since this morning. Get up with us. You people of the first three where you can't sleep like this. If you're so good, great days. I don't know. It's prohibited. Well, maybe I'll just get a dog instead. We can go to the revolution now. They will let us in through the tears. Anything goes. But hey, I won't twist your arm. Just don't come back in 10 minutes when you change your mind. It will be a I just can't hit a woman, but you are an entirely different subject. Did you hear that? Oh, sure. You're coming. Well, Stanislavski, you can watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room. If you'd be so kind, the can
with you. No, enjoy the show. Sorry, man. Time to move on. You patron of the art. So glad to see you. Where have you been? You don't like us anymore? Helen, no, что? I'm, I'm totally in love with you girls, but I've been busy with work. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I'll come back soon. I promise. Yeah, ты Jana, let me use your powder. In your dreams, you have your own. It's no good. Why can't your boyfriend buy you something better? Boyfriend, she needs that part. Artyom, Artyom, looks like you're a bit woman hungry, huh? Well, yes, yes, it's a hard life. It's a soft life. What's going on? What else? Another war. Anyways, I tell you, we should be going, but. Uh, Let's dream to the fact we are still alive, huh? Tell me, okay? Ali, go! Here you are. Two of our specials from the old stock. Been infusing it for half a year. Opa! That's great! So, let's drink it to him! Smooth stuff, huh? And this is a good place, but uh, home is the best, you know? You know, I've traveled all over the metro and people talk all kinds of shit about the Red Line. That it's awful there, there's no food, that we shoot comrades for nothing, and you can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom! Wow, so... <clears throat> yes, our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but... We have order, and everything is shared. Food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true, but no beggars either. Another drink. And now, to equality. Come on, Artyom. No, 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 pay that now. Ooh, хорошо прошла. Ah, where was I? Ah, yes. Yes, look, look at the far stations. The freaking... Eat each other, sell their kids as slaves, it's like the Stone Age. And after his own devices, a man becomes a beast, you know? Order, order, is all that matters. That's, that's our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order. Блин. Come on, Artyom, come on. Bottoms up. Bottoms up. So, my friend, that's how it goes. Don't be mad, Artyom. Just doing my job to protect the red line. And you, Musketeer, are from the wrong side of the barricade. Private, take this comrade in. Yes, Major, sir. Yes, sir. That was so stupid of me. I bought that talk of friendship. The stupid musketeer saying, Just you wait. I will get even. I wonder though, why did Pavel go through the trouble of trapping me? Yeah. It's just being over enthusiastic, you know? Artyom, look, I think of you as my friend, really. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. Good day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, товарищ. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops, sir. The Secretary General? Yeah? What about Comrade Corp? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Oppa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, Artyom, 
You're smart guys, so we understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need information. So, my advice to you, my friend, cool. Okay? But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us. General. Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbut. This stranger here, uh, saved me. What a coincidence. He's Nitsky, one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Comrade Artyom. I think we both have something to offer. Take the... Comrade to the negotiation room. Young man, let's dispense with the info doctor is and conditions. This telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark One, is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. But, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers, one for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Corbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lyonium must start learning how to improve his, uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were... Da, ah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! <laughs> Your balls in pig fat. Passwords, code names, operation protocols. What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonia. Interrogation. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No. You little shit. There's no power without blood. There is. Your brother ruled peacefully. And they still love him! Get back here! You're a thug. God damn it! All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers. Just get everything out of him and shoot the bastard. And then come to my office. We must talk. Come back here! You may be my son. Oh, I must agree with you on it. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection, and you will tell us everything.
I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the dark one? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. Fuck Corbett! Fuck my father! And Morozov! And the revolution and my own future! I'd rather be shot and end up like father, killing his own brother! Listen, if you get out of here, just, well, just live! Here! Get in there! This is the way to freedom! Believe me, I know. <laughs> I spent all my childhood hiding from my father in those vents! Clayton, sit down, Corbett. Let's talk. About the negotiations in Polis? Ah, so you already know. I am the head of intelligence, after all. Then why did you let the information leak? Damn the refugees. Polis, Hansa, and even the fucking Nazis already know about our plans. The rats will be exterminated. And war is inevitable anyway. Inevitable? I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man is a fearful man. How dare you! You're the head of state security and you report to me! Yes, but now, when we are one step away from a unified red metro, you have no right to disrupt the plan. I have no right? I'm... Moscovin. When you asked me how to deal with your elder brother when he was still the Secretary General, I helped you. And after his tragic death, I bucked your takeover. So I suggest you take my advice again. This is unacceptable. It's very simple, Comrade Moskvin. We all stand together, arms linked against the wind. Or it's every man for himself. But, Gorbuk, is this whole fucking metro truly worth the blood we're going to spill? I have a way of doing it without spilling any blood. No blood, you say? All right. Go do your trick. I'll handle the Politburo. Godzilla. One of these days. A frontal assault is hopeless. But if we go underground at the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack from the rear, we should encounter little or no resistance. Then we just have to do a sweep. Attention! Comrade General! Soldiers, you are trusted with an important mission. Each group has its task, and you have been told only what you need to know to succeed. But remember that this operation is top secret, and you must not be taken alive by the enemy. I hope that I am understood. Questions? Can we use radios after we capture the assigned targets? Only in case of emergency, and on a scrambled frequency. If we're faced with strong enemy counterattacks, do we hold the positions or fall back? Hold them. Anyway, the enemy is unlikely to mount an effective counteroffensive. Comrade General, we have been issued a banner along with the other gear, but we were also made to remove all our markings. We will leave no trace of our operation. Only upon victory and receipt of the following signal will you raise your banner over the captured targets. Further questions? No, Comrade General. Good luck, then. Surrender! 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 Surrender!
Now I am in a real spider-infested catacombs, where the general secretary...